Okay, so here we are. Uh, welcome to this uh, point of view shot that we have. I know my screen is quite tiny, but I need you to be able to see the other equipment here. So I've got the Studio 24, the Presonus. It's all plugged in and uh, ready to go. And I know it's ready to go because I can see the blue light on the front of it, okay? So I can see the blue light uh, right here. So let me just move that back a little bit more so you can see that. Okay, so there we go. So I've got a blue light there. Everything's looking good. Um, I don't have the headphones on yet. I just have them around my neck because don't ever put headphones on until you know what the audio levels are. So uh, this 48 volt one, you don't, you don't need that one on. The mixer, I'm just gonna have straight up and down, okay? So, and then uh, the number one, I'm gonna have maxed out. Number two, I'm gonna have it zero. The main at zero, the headphones at zero. And again, I have the blue light on and uh, things should be good there. Okay, so that's where we're good there. My headphone setting on here, I'm gonna set that at half. I just, before I put headphones on, I do not wanna have things set at full because I don't wanna hurt my ears. So I think I'm pretty good there. So now uh, I'm gonna add the tracks right up here. Right up here is the plus button. I'm gonna add a track. I'm gonna make sure it's a mic or line. Okay, and I'm gonna hit create. Okay, so now we have an audio track there. Now I'm gonna do a couple of things I need to check. I gotta go up to GarageBand and down to settings. And I'm gonna double check uh, under audio MIDI. My output should be these guys right here. It should say external headphones. And my input should say Studio 24C, which is the PreSonus right here. So everything is good there. If it doesn't say those, then you're not gonna have the right input and output. So you gotta make sure that double check that that's exactly how it is. So those are good to go. All right, I'm gonna put my headphones on. Okay, and uh, I'm talking into the microphone now and I can hear my voice, so I can hear, but I'm only coming out one side. So I've got to open up the um, settings. Make sure that the, the new track that you've just selected, let me rewind to the beginning here. So this new track, and let me zoom out a little bit just so you can see the whole, whole song. There it is, okay. So um, I'm only coming out one side, so I'm gonna hit this little, it's like a dial with some dots around it. I'm gonna touch that button. That's gonna open up the track editor and I'm going to make sure that this orange monitoring light is on. So this orange one should be on. And then where it says input here, I'm going to tap that one and it should go from two circles to one circle. And then you'll notice you're now in both ears. You're in stereo now. And so we've taken a mono source of just a single microphone and now we split it into left and right in your ears. Okay, I've also got this, the song lyrics here, so it's ready to go. And uh, just for fun, I'm gonna put on the countdown timer. It's gonna count one, two, three, four, and then start playing the song, just to help me get um, into the right part of the song. Also, when I record the choruses later, it's gonna count down in as well as that. So it's a little, the countdown timer is kind of helpful for recording vocals, and you can turn that off uh, when you're done. So I've got that turned on, and I think we're ready to, um, to do this. So I'm at the beginning of the song, I've got my, my lyrics here and I'm just gonna wrap it okay and I'm gonna wrap just the verses so verse 1 verse 2 verse 3 and then we're gonna make another track and record the chorus on the other track so let me just go here and press record you can't hear it but I can hear the song now playing in my ear okay I didn't start at the right time let me just go back again okay it's freaking me out because you're over my shoulder and you can't hear the song. So it's gonna sound really odd to you, but the we can't have the song playing in the room because it'll be picked up by the microphone. So you can only do vocal recordings when you have headphones on. That's the only way you can do it, unless you're like in a on a concert stage and there's a different way of setting up those. But just in studio work, you can never ever ever have the music playing out in the room and record with a microphone. You've always got to do it with the headphones. Okay, so let's try this again here. And um, in fact, let's make another video. Come back in the next video and we'll record uh, the verses to this song.